Hi guys, this is Sadek from Droidman.com and in this video, we will show you how to go back to the old Wikipedia theme without making a new Wikipedia account. So in this regard, I had made a video recently in which I had shown you how you could go back to the old Wikipedia UI layout and in this task, you had to make a new account, then go to the notification and from there select settings or preferences and then go to the appearance tab. From appearance, select Vector Legacy 2010, then click on save and you will be back to the old Wikipedia layout. Let me show you. So this is the old layout and let's search for a page as well. So as you could see, we are now back to the old layout. However, many users have said in the comment section that they do not want to make a new account just for this very purpose. And this is completely understandable. So is there a way wherein you could bring back the old layout without making a new account? Well, there does exist a couple of workarounds using which you could get this job done. First and foremost, let's log out of the Wikipedia account just a minute let me log out from this page and so as of now as you could see i am no longer logged into my account and let's open a page so this is the new wikipedia layout and i am no longer logged into any account so let me show you how you could go back to the old wikipedia layout without making account so in this regard your first fix will be using a url tweak for that you just need to add this parameter at the end of the url is question mark use skin equals to vector so copy this and add it at the end of the URL and hit enter. As you could see, we are now back to the old Wikipedia layout by adding this parameter at the end. You could add this at the end of any URL and it will be back to the old layout. However, the major issue with this is that you will have to manually add this parameter at the end of every URL, which will take up quite a lot of time. Fortunately, there exists one more method using which you could automate this task and that is possible by using an extension. So once you install an extension, it will automatically add this parameter at the end of every Wikipedia layout. So let me show you how that could be done. So first off, let's go back to the new layout. And this is a new layout as you could see. So you will now have to install the extension known as old Wikipedia extension for Google Chrome. Or you could use Fire, if you're using Firefox, then use the Wikipedia vector skin or classic mode. So as of now, I'm using Google Chrome. So you could use the old Wiki extension. So go there and click on add to Chrome, then click on add extension and the extension will now be added onto your PC, onto the browser. Once that is done, just have a look at the URL. Once I refresh it, it has automatically added the use skin vector and we are now back to the old Wikipedia layout. So what this extension does is it simply adds this parameter at the end of every URL. So let's search for something else. Let me search for Microsoft. And if I do so, and as you will, as you could see, we are back with the old UI layout. So it will automatically add this parameter at the end of every URL, meaning you will not have to carry out the manual task every time. However, some of you might have a few question marks regarding this extension because it's a new extension and only quite only 580 users have installed till now. And that is also completely understandable due to privacy concern. So it's completely your choice whether you want to use this automated process of extension or you want to go to the manual process that requires adding this parameter at the end of every URL. Apart from that, you always have the option to make a new account and then by making a new account, you can go to the appearance tab and select the vector legacy theme as I've shown in the beginning. So guys, these were the two methods from which you could go back to the old Wikipedia layout if you don't want to make a new theme. And if you want to remove the extension, you could do that very easily as well. Just click on the extension menu and after that, click on the overflow icon next to old wiki and click on remove from Chrome. Then click on remove. It will remove the extension and you will be back on the new Wikipedia layout. As you could see, we just need to remove this extension and we will be back on the new layout. So from now on, if you want to go back to the old layout, you will have to just simply add this tweak manually every time. So guys, the choice is all yours. Do let me know which method are you ultimately planning to settle with. And on that note, we round off this video. If you have any queries, do let me know in the comment section. And guys, please subscribe to the channel for more tips and tricks. Thanks a lot for watching.